I don't like chocolate, but I love white chocolate. But I like brownies with nuts. I don't know. I feel like that got pretty sexual really quick, but I'm just gonna stop talking right there. Shush, shush. Shush, shush, shush. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today I'm going to be showing you how I get my super bronzed, glowy, goddess, if you will, look. All of us women are goddesses. All of us. All of us. I love this look, especially in the summer. I love to look bronzed because in the winter I am not bronzed. I am translucent. I am so pale. It's kind of scary. Like you could almost see through me. So when the summertime comes and I can start getting that tan on, I love to bronze it up. I love to highlight it up. I love to do it up because I'm a dry skin girl. I don't get very dewy ever. Don't forget before you leave today to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you have not already so you can be a part of this awesome family and this journey that I'm going on giving you all my makeup tips, my goofiness, and probably a lot of laughs throughout the video. So I will stop rambling now and we can just get on to the video. For primer today, I'm going to be using my Milani Prime Perfection Primer. And we are just going to make a mess of it. Warm it up on our fingertips and dab this all into the problem areas. And once again, don't judge the nails. Don't judge them. Don't judge them. They look like dogs chewed on the tips. They didn't. They didn't. I just have neglected them. Other things are more important than the look of my nails, so don't judge. <laughs> and as usual, to correct another problem area on my face, my dark circles, I am using my NYX Dark Circle Color Corrector. For foundation today, I'm going to be using the, Mil the Milani Conceal and Perfect 2-in-1 foundation, and I am in the shade Warm Beige. I'm just going to pop some on the back of my hand. I do about two squirts of this and go in, of course, with the Dan Beauty Blender and just start blending it as I go. Move these hairs out of the way because we definitely don't want them all foundationed up. Today I'm going to be using the Too Faced Chocolate Bar. The first shade I'm going to be using is this shade right here. It is called Sartid. Sartid? Sartid. It is called Sart. It's called <laughs> Salted Caramel. I'm just going to apply this in my crease and all over my lid area. Windshield wiper motions back and forth in my crease. And circular motions on the lid. Could do my eyebrows. Could do those. Totally forgot to throw them on. Let me throw them on, we come right back to the eyes. Now that we got some brows on, let's go back to salted caramel. Do some windshield wiper motions in our crease and circular motions on our lid. to be going in with the shade semi-sweet and I'm just going to apply a light amount of this color in my crease just going back and forth windshield wiper motions nothing too heavy I have something in my eye and I can't find it anyways going back and forth nothing too heavy just a very light hand with this just a little bit of product you just want something subtle to be using is this beautiful shade right here. It's called White Chocolate. Mom life. <laughs> I'm just going to take this pro shader brush from Fresh 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 brush from Sephora and I'm just going to apply this all over my lid. I'm then going to curl my lashes. As usual, giving them some volume, girl. For mascara, I'm going to be using the Lancome Grandiose Extreme Mascara. This is my favorite mascara of all time now, ever since it has come into my life. Nothing compares. Nothing. Other than false lashes. Nothing. I am going to be throwing on lashes today, so I only did one coat of mascara and not a bajillion since I'm going to be throwing on falsies to add that extra volume. And the lashes that I am using are the Salon Perfect in the 615. 
for concealer, I'm going to be using the Maybelline Fit Me Concealer in shade Sand. Last time I said tan. I did correct myself in the video though, but it is sand. And I'm just going to put a dot right there, a dot right there, and one right there, and then we're just going to connect them like so. Same thing for the other side. And I just want to do a couple dots up my nose onto my forehead, highlight the cupid's bow area as well as dot some craziness on my chin. And then blend it all out with my trusty handy dandy damp beauty blender. Under these eyes, I'm going to be using the Wet n Wild Color Icon Bronzer. I know it says bronzer, it's very light, so I use it to set under my eyes. It is great, and it's drugstore and affordable, and the shade is in my cabana. It just gives you, like, it just sets it in, but also gives you a nice glow that looks like it's coming from within at the same time. It's just really nice. Very nice, very nice. To set this face, as usual, Flower Beauty Powder, shade L01, my go-to powder, heaven in a container. Just great. And drugstore, even better! Alrighty, alrighty, alrighty then. One of my favorite movies of all times. Since this whole look is about a bronzy goddess glow. We're gonna get to bronzing, girl, gonna get to bronzing. I'm going to start with Benefits Hula Bronzer, and I'm just going to apply this in the hollows of my cheeks and around my forehead, because we are going to be adding another type of bronzer with this one, so we don't wanna go too heavy with it. A little bit around the chin area, we just want everything to flow and be even, and I have a bristle of hair hanging out of my nose. Next, I'm going to be using NYX Ombre Blush, and this is going to be in the shade Nude to Me, and I'm just going to apply, oh, apply, I'm just going to apply, I'm just going to apply. <laughs> this is a two-tone blush. It is so pretty. You can take both of the colors, rub them together like that, get this really pretty bronzy color. You can do one color, whole, you can do just that color. I like to mix them together. This is the mixed one. So you can see, just by those swatches, it's very pigmented, so be very careful when applying this to your face. I'm just going to use an angled brush from Sephora that, yes, it actually is recently cleaned, just stained all to hell. So I'm going to very lightly dab these two together, and then I just want to apply, see how pigmented? Just a little to my cheekbones on both sides. You really only need one touch of this product to go on both cheeks for this look. That's how pigmented this is. And once again, NYX is drugstore, very affordable. I'm obsessed with these blushes, obsessed. I'm then going to go, I'm then going to go on with a stippling brush from Sephora and I'm going to blend these together. Blend until your little heart desires, girl. Just keep blending just like the most best thing in the world. Anastasia Beverly Hills Glow Kit does it again. She's amazing, she's amazing. The color that we are going to be using, or the shade I might say, is bronzed. Lord Jesus! It's a beautiful color. I'm just going to actually use that same stippling brush that we were blending all this out with and once again, a little goes a long way with this girl because she knows how to make her stuff and it's pigmented. Pigmented. <laughs> so we're just gonna do a little bit and we are just going to blend this in with the bronzer and the blush that we already had. You can already see it. Starting to get that glow. Oh my God, this is just, no words. We are going to go back in with, with Too Faced Chocolate Bar and we are going to use the shade Sarted again, can't say it. We are going to use the shade Salted Caramel and we are going to line our lower lash line with this shade. 
and to plot some mascara on our bottom lashes because I don't care if you have one lash or two or three bottom lashes. Always mascara. Always mascara them up, girl, because it's going to give you just a more put-together look, and it's not going to make you look dead down here. It's just going to bring you, bring your eyes out, make them pop. Rock your lashes, rock those bottom lashes, don't hide them. And I'm going to be using Maybelline's Colossal Volumizing Express Mascara. And then because I like to be a little extra, I'm going to go back in with the Anastasia Beverly Hills Glow Kit and I'm going to be using this shade right here, Moonstone, and I'm just going to apply a little bit of this directly on top of my cheekbones. Just adding a little bit more glow. Because we don't really have enough, right? <laughs> Bringing it up into my temples. And here we are going to apply it to the tip of our nose. Our Cupid's bow. Chin. And down the bridge of your nose. I'm then going to take my NYX Dewy Finish Spray. I'm going to spray the back of that same damp beauty blender. And I'm just going to pounce that highlighter into my skin. Just making it look more natural. More glowy. And if you're wearing like a tank top or a low-cut shirt, I'm not. I have just a cute little comfy tee on. You can actually bronze your cheek, your cheekbones. Bronze these cheekbones. <laughs> you can actually do a little bit of highlight right here on your collarbones and on your the tops of your shoulders. And it'll just make everything just really come together and really pop. But for my lippies, I'm going to be using the color, the color Splash Lipstick by Tarte. This is in the shade Beach Babe. Mm, love this guy. Love it. When I'm all bronzed up, I like to give my lips a little bit of a bronzy lippy look. They get their own look. They get their own bronzy lippy look. <laughs> and for that, I can accomplish it by using my Wet n Wild Mega Slips Slips Mega Slicks Lip Gloss in the shade Rose Gold. I love rose gold. I love anything that looks bronzy. And I love this stuff. And it's a dollar. One dollar. Mm. And I'm just going to set this face in with my Tarte Ready Set Radiant Spray to give me that extra radiant bronzed goddess glow look. I don't know why I have to sing. Why do I have to sing? It just makes it awkward. That was it, you guys. It was very simple. The Anastasia Beverly Hills Glow Kit Palette has really just come into the most favoritest of favorites of mine, especially this summer with that bronzed highlighter. Oh my lord. I hope you guys like this video. It's very simple to do. Give yourself that bronze look, that sun kiss look. Who doesn't love that in the summer? And anytime I can get that sun kiss look, I will take it because like I said, I'm a pale girl and I only got a few months to rock this. If you like this video, please don't forget to give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. And that is all I have to say for now, you guys. I hope you love this video. Thank you for all of your love and support. Once again, it really does mean the world to me and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.